inspired me to get into gymnastics? I guess there wasn't one specific thing. I first got involved because I was very hyperactive as a child. I was breaking everything in the house, jumping off sofas. Uh, what inspired me to get into gymnastics was my nan, actually, which is kind of weird. Uh, and around the age of six or seven, we were watching the Olympics together and we came across gymnastics. She knew how energetic I was and was kind of like, I think you could do that. And I saw it on the TV during the Beijing Olympics and that's really when I started taking it seriously. And then next day I knew she enrolled me into a little gymnastics class uh, and then, you know, the rest is history. Uh, who should we be looking out for at the Gymnastics World Cup? Um, my teammate, Bryn Bevan. There's sort of three names from British gymnastics that have been announced and um, I'm one of those, so I'm really hoping to get there. So if I am there, definitely look out for me. My training regime doesn't really change leading into a major competition. It's all about consistency, so it's just repetition, making sure that I've done enough numbers and I've practiced enough of the routines. It just gets really, really intense. The work rate goes up quite a bit and we obviously have to get fit within these eight weeks. So we just do a lot more fitness work uh, up in the gym. Rituals and mantras before a competition. Um, there's no one specific thing. I literally take my kit bag out, make sure everything's sort of there that I need. Stick to a good sleeping pattern, make sure that my breakfast is relatively healthy, full of like carbs and things that will give me energy throughout the day. Yeah, just sort of listening to the right music. I just listen to like such a mixture of stuff. Like I have like some like heavy metal rock. Nice, nice chill stuff. I'm not very often put in charge of the music when we're training. The others don't like my taste. Who should we be looking up for at the British Championships? There's a, a whole like household full of names. Get behind all of the South Essex guys. Uh, myself, Max, Jay, we all train at South Essex. There's literally so many names from our squad that are doing really well at the moment. Um, so it's, it's hard to pick one, but pretty much all of us in top squad are fighting fit at the moment and we're looking, looking like a strong team. Have I ever encountered any setbacks in my career? I've encountered quite a few. I dislocated my elbow and I snapped pretty much everything off of it. It's in 2015 when I broke my leg. I had to have reconstructive surgery. I pretty much had every doctor telling me it will be incredibly hard for you to get back at gymnastics. The day after my operation, I was straight back in the gym. Like I could obviously couldn't use my leg or walk it and stuff, but I was making sure that the rest of my body was in the best condition that it could be. I was trying to get stronger, I was trying to get fitter. My advice would be to find something that makes you happy in those times of struggle and just look at the bigger picture. For me, there's been two proudest moments in my career. Um, one of them was being part of the 2015 World Championship team where we came away with a silver medal. And my second proudest moment is going to the 2016 Rio Olympic. All the injuries that I've had sort of leading into it, being told that it was impossible to, in a six month time period, come back from a broken leg to get myself to, to the games. When I, when I finally did it, it, it just felt amazing. My proudest moment, uh, I've got two actually. One is a accolade, so I was junior European pommel champion in 2012, and second would be fighting back from my injury and proving people wrong. Any advice I'd give to someone looking to start gymnastics in 2019 is just, just get stuck in. Uh, there's, there's nothing you can sort of do to prepare yourself for it. You've just got to get involved and start enjoying it. Just get out there and do it. Honestly, there's, there's, there's no better time than now. Just, just get out there, try it, come to, come to an adult gym session, have a go. It's so fun.